In this video, what I want to show you is how to simplify uh, trig expressions involving uh, sine, cos, tan, uh, cosec, sec, and cot. Okay? So I want to make these simpler than they currently are. And one of the best ways to do this is to write each of them in terms of sine and cos. Okay? If you do that, usually it will make things simpler and easier to spot how this is going to work. So cosec is 1 over sine, and we're multiplying that with sine over cos. And what you should be able to see here is that the sines will cancel each other out. And we're just going to be left with 1 over cos. But 1 over cos, we already know, well, that's sec. So cosec tan is sec. Okay. Let's look at tan x cot x. Well, tan x is sine over cos sine over cosine. And cot is cosine over sine. Now what's going to happen is that we have a sine that's going to cancel with that sine, and the cosine is going to cancel with that cosine, and so this is just going to be 1 over 1, or just 1. Okay. Now you could also see that as tan times 1 over tan, okay? which will be 1 as well. Sine x cosec x, well we have sine x times 1 over sine x. So this sine will cancel with that sine and you're just going to get left with 1. Okay. Sec x sine x, well sec x is 1 over cos times by sine. And so here we're just going to get sine x over cos x, which we know is tan. Okay, so sec x sine x is the same as tan x. Finally, cosec over sec. Cosec is 1 over sine, and that's divided by 1 over cos. Now, 1 over sine divided by 1 over cos is the same as 1 over sine times cos over 1. Now 1 over sine times cos over 1 will just be cos over sine, which we know is cot. So cosec over sec is the same as cot. Okay. So this is how we can simplify uh, trigonometric expressions like this, and a good method to use, change everything into sines and cosses and see what cancels out. And then finally, write an answer where it is simplified down to one trig function, if you can.